Hey, this is Jeff with Diversified Energy. Here we are at Uptown House, New Orleans. And the homeowner here gave us a call just a couple days ago and said, you know what, I have some high energy bills, I'm just not comfortable, it's always humid in my house. Can you guys come over and take a look? Well, we did. We took a look and we realized the ductwork was just, well, it was just really, really shoddy is what it was. So, here we are, we're ready to fix the problem. He's gonna be a lot more comfortable, much better indoor air quality. It's gonna save some money on his bills too. So, let's go ahead and take a look. Here we are in an attic, along with this beautifully messed up spray foam roof line. And now we're gonna hit the ductwork. Because again, this is what we live for, the down and dirty of fixing other contractors' mess ups, right? So, this ductwork is absolutely atrocious. First of all, I could stick my hand inside what we call the collar right here, inside what we call the supply air plenum. Now, there are some reasons why that may not be bad for a spray foam attic, but we'll get into that one on another video. As of right now, we have, we have kinks, we have things compressed against each other. Uh, this is slammed up against the two by six rafter. This is pushing it down. And as it goes over into the third story, it is nearly taking a 90 degree real rough angle. Um, so what we're gonna do is come back, properly strap all this so it's gonna be nice, it's gonna be rounded and won't be any kinks, they won't be slammed up against each other. It's gonna be a lot better for the airflow. And if it's better for the airflow, that means more air into your bedrooms, your living room, your kitchen, and means a much lower bill, and you're gonna be a lot more comfortable.